Hi guys, so today I'm going to do another haul, um, and I've been wanting to do this haul since I got back from California, but I didn't really get that much things in California, so I thought I would wait more till I bought stuff, but let's get started. Um, first of all, I'm going to start off with the little things, like the little stuff that I got from my trip. Um, start off with this. I got this in Vegas. It is from the store called It's Sugar. It's still in its wrapper because I still haven't opened it and I don't know where to put it. But it's a candle. And hold on. It's a candle from, I mean, it's a candle. It's a Jolly Rancher candle. And it's um, watermelon flavored. It smells so good. I wish you guys could smell like YouTube or the future <laughs> starts making a technology where you can smell the video or what they're smelling. Oh, I just wish you guys can smell this. It smells delish. Like, I'd love to eat it. It looks like that. See? Jolly Rancher Watermelon. And sorry, the video is dark. It's like 9.20 at night. And I'm doing this right now. Um, and it's kind of loud outside my house because they just came back from a party. Anyways, and then I got this one. I've been wanting this since it came out. Um, I got it in San Diego at the military base in Mira Mesa. I got Rihanna's Perfume Rebel Flair. I got it for $39.50. If I bought this here, it would have been at least $70. And I got the big bottle, the... A hundred, the 100 milliliter one and this smells really good and if you know me you know I love Rihanna I'm like the biggest one of Rihanna's biggest fan but yeah I got that from San Diego and I got oh I did say it, I got from 39.50 and then I got this sweater from Seaport Village in San Diego and I got it for $29.99 it's the lifeguard San Diego sweater. See, got it in white and red. It also came in black, but I wanted white. But yeah, that's from San Diego. And then the last thing I got from my trip were these shoes from Chic. We don't have Chic here in Vancouver, so. And I've been wanting these when I saw these back in May, but I didn't have my size in Seattle. So I got it in Fashion Valley in San Diego, again. And it's these loafers. They're the cheetah print loafers with gold studs and spikes. They're not studs. They're gold spikes and, like, sequins. I'll do a close-up so you guys can see, but... They're really, really nice, and I haven't worn these yet because I don't know where to wear, what to wear it, but there's this um, African-American girl that said you should buy it because I know you can work it, but who knows? Maybe I can't. Maybe I could. Maybe I will. Who knows? Um, but yeah, I got these four. Actually, my cousin got them for me. I got it for $44.97, but I'm pretty sure they were on sale. I think they were on sale 40%. But yeah, I got that from Fashion Valley. Pretty sure they still have it at any other chic store. And then I got this sweater from Joe Fresh. It's just like a cotton, a 60% cotton and 40% acrylic sweater that I got from Joe Fresh at my work and I got this on sale. It was twelve ninety four. See? And it was a it's like last season, so I was like, oh whatever, might as well get it. Put a denim shirt under or something, a collared shirt. Getting ready for winter because it's starting to get cold here in Canada. In Vancouver specifically. But I got that for twelve ninety four. Then I got these slim pants that are like Airy cloth material. I got in a size 6, but I think I should have gotten a size 4 because they do stretch out a bit. But I got it at Joe Fresh as well, and I got it for $19. 
They're really, really cute. And I don't know if I mentioned, but I'm pretty sure they did. I did. It's terry cloth. It's really nice. It's a, I got this in the blue and a mustard. Me? I'm thinking of getting the um, uh, forest green, but I don't know yet. Because my boyfriend has those and they look good on him, but he's light skinned and I'm like hella dark, so who knows? I still gotta try it on, but I got these two <gasps> and they're really nice. So I'm gonna do accessories now. Um, I'll start off with necklaces. There, I have like three of the same thing, but like different styles. So there's this one. It's a black long necklace. See? I don't know if you guys can see. It's pretty long. I don't even know if I'm going to use it. I don't know. It was an impulsive buy. <laughs> but it's black and like gold. If you can like see it on the light. Um, I got this for eleven eighty. I don't know what I was thinking, but yeah. That. And then I got another one that's black and gold. But it has like a different... It's like tassel kind of thingy here. It's also black and gold. I think I just said that. I don't know. It's getting late. Um, it's kind of different. It's thicker and it's not as long. And there's more chains on this one than this one. And I got this one for $7.80. This one's cute too, but I don't know what I'm going to do with these. I don't even know. Impulsive buys. And then I got another one that's black and gold. But with silver this time, it's kind of the same thing. Different style, like I said. And it looks like this. And I got this for $7.80 as well. I seriously don't know what I'm going to do with this. I don't know what I do with my money sometimes. This one I actually like. It has like a vintage copperish gold color to it. It's a triangle necklace, see? It's like a tribal kind of triangle. And I got this one for $5.80. I just got this today, so... Not bad. I actually really like it. It's cute. Then I got four bracelets. Um, the first one looks like this. Um, I got this one for $5.80. And it's just a chain bracelet. See? It's pretty cute and simple. Simplicity at its best. Yeah, I got this one, and then I got this one that has like a clasp. See? Looks like this. It's so cute. Um, I got this one for $7.80 again. And it looks like this. See? Clasp right here. It's not that hard to put on. Just put it on your wrist. Blam! And then I got this one. This silver one. For... 1880 and I got two of these. It's really cute. It's like the spikes that everyone has now. One had like part of it has rhinestones. It'd be rhinestones, then like just the silver cone, and then rhinestones and silver cone, and so it alternates. Looks like I got it in. I got two of these in silver and two in black. The black one's really cute too. Yeah, that's pretty much what I got. Oh, wait. These as well. This bracelet holder. I got it from Michael's. Oh, oops, it fell. But I got this one for... They had a special going on where you buy one and then get one 30% off. Or something like that. I got it before I left for California. But I got two of these and I also got the... Oh my god, it keeps falling. I also got the ring holder. And I forgot how much I got these for. I'm pretty sure you could still get it at a local Michael store. Because they had a lot. They came in black and white. And I think it was like a beigey brown. I could be wrong. Ugh. But yeah. Hope you guys liked it. Um, don't forget to follow me on Instagram. It's Paul Zedrick. That's P-A-U-L. Z. Z. Or Z. Or Z. Whatever. We say Z here in California. Uh, in Canada. Z E D R I C H. Paul A U L Z E D R I C H. Follow me on Instagram, Twitter, um, Tumblr, and my Facebook page. If I add you, or if I don't add you. If I don't add you, I'm sorry. I just barely go on that social network anymore because it's just getting complicated every time it gets updated. Okay, I sound like a robot. 
Um, but yeah. <sighs> Bye! Hey guys, so I totally forgot to add this to my haul. Um, I also got Ray-Bans that my boyfriend got me for a month stream when we were there. He got me the... What is it called? The RB3026 Aviator glasses in gold. See? It's really cute. He knows he knew I've been wanting these. And he gave it to me. I didn't even know. I had no clue. Um, sorry I'm rushing. It's like the day, my first day of school today. And I had to leave you in 40 minutes. And I still had to eat and pack my stuff. But, but yeah, he got me those. And he got these from Fashion Valley at the sunglasses hut store there and I forgot to show you guys these um if any of my YouTube subscribers follow me on Twitter Instagram or have me on Facebook me and my boyfriend got our caricature caricatures done in Vegas and it turned out like this <laughs> I don't know if you guys can see but I'll do a close-up but that's how it looks like and you guys can probably tell who is who because, yeah, let me take out the plastic so you guys can actually see properly. Because the plastic's reflecting. But that's how it looks. The hair is very detailed. It's actually really nice. But it made us look hella gay. Like, gayer than we look now, I guess. Um, but it's cute. I like it. And, yeah. Okay, well, I gotta get ready for school and, well, I am ready. I gotta eat. I have a class at, from 6 to 10. It's ridiculous. But, yeah, and it's hot. Um, by the way, um, I need your guys' help. Uh, I need suggestions on what other videos I should do because I feel like I'm boring my subscribers with just my vlogs and OOTDs and I don't know. I haven't even done an OOT in a while. But I need you guys' suggestions. Maybe an Ask Me Anything video. Uh, some people have been asking a hair tutorial, but I want to see if other any other people want to see me do my hair, how I do it. Even though, yeah. <laughs> um, also, there's a boyfriend tag that should be coming soon, depending with my boyfriend and I's schedule. We were supposed to do that, but never got the chance to, but yeah, I keep saying but, 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 but.